Well, you know what that means. It was bound to happen eventually. Hello everyone and welcome to Mario and Luigi Superstar Sega. Why am I playing a Sega game? This is a, this is a Nintendo year. Yes, to, to finish off the year of me actually playing Mario games. The Goodwill Ambassador from the Bean Bean Kingdom has arrived. If for some reason I wish to improve my kingdom's ties with the Mushroom Kingdom, I bring a gift from Queen Bean. Blah! Enjoy the fart gas. <laughs> Man, that is just a great villain design. Just putting that out there. Now we steal the fart gas, and it is our own Princess Peach fart gas. <laughs> but yes, if some of y'all remember, because it'll be gone by now, uh, I might have an abandoned Let's Play of this from a decade ago and uh, never finished it. The emergency stations! Did you see the Kingdom Courier? Mario! This is what the inside of Mario's house looks like. Mario and Luigi share separate beds. We have the tool cabinet. And a... Why is there... There's a red sink thing, but shouldn't there be a green sink on the other side? It, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. And now for the one canonical time that Toad saw Mario's mushroom. Mmm, I hear humming. This is a weird game. Why is Mario trying to kill that toad? Princess Peach! Princess Peach! Mario also can't be bothered to run out uh, without putting clothes on. He has to grab. He only. So Mario only has one pair of clothes, canonically, that we're drawing there. Didn't keep any more inside the house. But yeah, it's time to actually do this game. One of my favorite games of all time. Talk to me while my back is turned, huh? Well, that's typical. Come here, super coward bros. <clears throat> Bowser's gonna be tough on me. And I already tell you that today. Oh yeah, it's an RPG, by the way. Um, Mario! I wouldn't tell you a bunch of useless stuff. When was your last back? I, I already... Uh, no, I know what I'm doing. Yeah. So I'm not gonna be voicing just everything in this. Again, I I cowered out on doing the voices on some stuff, and I don't need to explain how everything works. Um, this is just a casual fun play for me, just to basically say I've got this game in the in the bag. Yes, it's important to know that you can actually dodge Bowser's attacks, but I've already been doing that. Um, this is a timed battle, not or rather number of turns battle rather than, you know, actually doing so and so much damage, just to make sure you get through the whole tutorial. And you learn about, you know, hitting a button before landing on an enemy or avoiding enemy attacks. Uh, wait a second, listen, there's no time for fighting, e even though I won. Listen to me, everyone, something terrible has happened. The good old ambassador from our neighbor in the Bean Bean Kingdom just paid a visit. Yeah, the same voice, but it was no friendly visit. The ambassador stole Princess Peach's voice. Now, I want you to keep in mind that intro, and I want you to keep in mind that Princess Peach's voice is stolen right now and replaced with this explosive vocabulary. Princess Peach is literally summoning destructive bombs whenever she talks, and she's not stopping to talk. Uh, if, I can, if I kidnap Princess Peach in this state, she'll wreck my castle. Mario, do something s super. It is in the title. Mario, please go and retrieve Princess Peach's voice. Only you can do it. The perpetrator came from the Bean Bean Kingdom. If you head over there, you should be able to learn more. <laughs> yes, go capture that feed and bring back Princess or Peach's voice. Then I can kidnap her. This is all well and good. We'll take my Koopa Cruiser and reach the Bean Bean Kingdom in no time. Mario, you leave immediately. To this response, Princess Peach says lizard. And then wrecks the entire castle. 
this was a reasonable thing to do. So we're going on an adventure. Um, I could talk to everyone here and learn some inve important adventuring information, or I could just explore around and do the things that I was going to do naturally. Hey, that's the precious belongings I've been looking for. Thank you. You're the best, the best. Please take this in return. So not all toads sound like that. It was just those toads in the castle. So it's the, it's the red-headed toads, you know? They, they're the ones with that voice. Like that guy down there. Who I guess I'm gonna have to talk to. I do like a, uh, an RPG that has, like, traversal mechanics in it. You found a mushroom. Oh, wow. My mushroom. You got it for me? I guess he doesn't have that voice. Weird. Oh, thank you so much, yes. But... Say, you're going to the Bean Bean Kingdom soon, uh huh? You'd better keep it then. And please take this as a going away gift. I insist. And good luck with all your jumping and stuff over there in the Bean Bean Kingdom. Weird toad, but alright. Um, Kingdom Carrier, Volume 1, Royal Speech Bonds. The villain who stole the lovely voice of Princess Peach has fled to the Bean Bean Kingdom. Mario has reportedly been tapped for the rescue mission. As per usual, Luigi will stay home to guard the home front? Question mark. And in the time it took me to read that, they posted a new newsletter. Kingdom Carrier, Volume 2, Mario and Bowser team up. Our favorite hero, Mario, is leaving for the Bean Bean Kingdom with our least favorite villain, Bowser, who's green. Luigi's color, but I guess they do kind of share it. That's odd. With Bowser's imminent departure from the kingdom, cries of joy were heard from Princess Peach's castle. Uh, not sure how you could do that over the sound of the bombs, but... Ah! Oh, God! Trouble! I've gotten separated from the Bowser baddies. Um, listen, do you know where Lord Bowser has gone? Yeah, absolutely. I already know which way he went. He went that way. It's the only way that I haven't gone, so clearly he must be there. Okay, thanks. That's almost time to assemble, and boy, I can't miss that. I gotta hurry. Everything that I have done here was of utmost importance. Hey, bro, what's up? I love the Italian gibberish. Uh, yes, I do want to save... And it's always good to save the game. Just, you know, in case something terrible were to happen coming up any minute now, but, you know, just, 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 just don't worry about it. Master Mario! It would appear that I am just in time. I have prepared a suitcase for you to take with you on your long journey. I'm quite sure it will prove useful as it owns many items and outfits. Please, take it. You got a suitcase. Heck yeah. Just press select to open your suitcase and check the menu screen. Then you can use any items you found on your journey or even change your clothes. It's also a good idea to use that screen to double check your personal status. Once you board the Koopa Cruiser, you can take your time and look through it. Now then, I have one more parting gift, as it were. Some funds for your trip! Here you go! Ah, thank goodness we have a hundred coins. That's an entire life! So we should be safe in case we die. Oh gracious, Master Luigi, are you going to the Bean Bean Kingdom as well? Bye-bye. No, 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 no. Bye-bye. Ah, you're just off seeing Master Mario off. A capital idea. I do believe I'll join you, Master Mario. You are going on ahead. I shall be waiting for you in front of the Koopa Cruiser. You're not, you're not gonna come along? No, it's just, it's just a bye-bye. Okay, fair enough. Where the heck is everyone? Well, I mean, I did send you here in advance, so, you know, good for you. We're late. What were you doing? We're leaving right now. So get on board and make it snappy. Well, so what do you think? Incredible, isn't it? This is my newest weapon, the Koopa Cruiser. It's a nice battleship, I'll give him that. Mm, yes, very good. Now, all I need are my baddies. Bowser baddies! And, uh, of course, uh, it's not to scale on the map screen. 
I don't know how he would fit inside. <laughs> uh, what green blazes? Hey, you! Are you signing up to join my crew of pouch patties? I like that no one knows who Luigi is in this game, period. Uh, I see, I see. You want me to bring you along that badly, huh? Um, I actually, this might mean that Bowser and Luigi never interacted. Yes, you! <laughs> oh, that's rich. Don't be modest, Mr. Green. I mean, you look like a real pain, but I'll take you anyways. Bowser is desperate. Hey, you stop! Your gnarliness. The baddies have just arrived. Hey, let's assemble in the area over here, you blithering idiots. I love the music in this game. It's got some bombs. All baddies have assembled. We shall now begin boarding the Koopa Cruiser. <laughs> Good, then we can depart. And with an increased headcount, too. Excellent. Your filthiness boarding is now complete, except for one deserter. Move it, you idiots. Initiate cruiser pursuit. Well, this is going to go swimmingly. I do love Tiny Luigi. See, now this is what I should have used for my scrolling background instead of what you are seeing, which is, uh, well, the holdover from the Wario game <laughs> on the Game Boy Advance. I, you know, I just I couldn't be bothered. Hey, you, down there in the ship's belly, Mario and, uh, what's your name, Green Guy. Mario and uh, Mr. Green Mario brother guy. Look alive down there, will you two? We're about to arrive in the Bean Bean Kingdom. Press select to open your suitcase, arrange your stuff, and get ready to roll. And then report to the deck pronto. Got some EGAD tech there. Was the blood adjacent, one might say. I don't know why I respect the sanctity of the silence of a safe room, but you kind of got to do what you kind of got to do. I could talk to all those guys and figure out how to control my brothers, but you know what? Again, this is just a casual, relaxing time for me, and not necessarily for you. This is just knock this off of my to-do list for 10 years now. It's going back and finishing this. You're about to enter the Bean Bean Kingdom, so you have your passports with you, right? Well, looks like you got a suitcase there. Tell you what, go ahead and press select to open your suitcase, okay? Why, you've got them right here. These are your passports. But hey, there aren't any photos. Well, it just so happens I got this camera over here. Oh, no. Don't wake out about it, though. We're gonna take your pictures here. You should be just fine. Since the great Bowser has called you to the deck, I'll let you two cut the line. Oh, yeah. Good guy Koopa Trooper in his, like, bum bummer a helmet, like, cap thing. Snapping photos is easy. Just stand on that mat there. See? Right there. Step on the mat once you're ready. No hurry. I'm going to do Luigi's photo first. Okay, Mario. You step back nice and easy. Now, I'm going to take it. Oops, I forgot to tell you. Listen, when you're getting your pictures taken, stand still. Don't go pressing buttons on the control pad to hold the pose. Ah, right, Luigi, you held the pose. Press start to move in front of the line, then you stand on the mat. Now, Mr. Green Stash, you step back. Don't press the buttons. Great. Taking your passport photos on your boat. Aren't we all happy now? Happy all around. And they instantly developed into... Well, that's what we're going to be staring at for the rest of the game. I hope you're happy. Now I'm going to talk to this guy. Uh... Oh, and I gave him just a regular voice. Uh, that goes here, that goes there. Working the hold isn't easy, and if you mess up, you have to start all over again. Oh, Mario, it's me, that lost guy. 
Hey, thanks for telling me which way to go back in the Mushroom Kingdom. I was kind of panicking. But thanks to you, I was the first one to board the Koopa Cruiser. Here, let me give you this. And we got a 1-Up Mushroom to go with our 100 coins that should have already given us a 1-Up Mushroom. By, you know, the, the rules of equivalent exchange in the Mushroom Kingdom. Well, we are Donkey Kong now. Hey, watch it, you clumsy oaks. Don't break the Great Bowser's cargo. It's important stuff. The deck. Yeah, the deck's just up ahead. Uh, but before you go there, I need to make sure you won't slow Lord Bowser down. So I'll teach you how to fight as a pair. I uh, know, you know what? I'm good. All right, but it's not my fault if you get into hot water later because you think you knew everything. Yep, sorry. I already know everything. I already know how to do it all. Do I want to break the barrel? Well, I kind of have to. So instead of doing one mandatory combat uh, tutorial, we get a second mandatory combat tutorial we can't skip. Hey! Bowser won't get mad at me if I don't whip you to save, so even if you don't want to, listen up. Let me show you how to dodge. Why did you give me a combat tutorial when I've already had a combat tutorial from Toad? We just use A and B. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Yes, I know how to... Yes, we, we already had this optional tutorial at the beginning. And then Luigi gets B. It's the simple, simple as can be. Yes, you know, and, and Luigi uses B for everything. There are two buttons on the Game Boy controller. Can you figure out which one does what? Ta-da! We win! Okay, this is setting a bad precedent for the Mario and Luigi games to come. I'm just gonna put that out there, that they might be a little bit too handholdy in future uh, titles, and that is lessons taken entirely from this first hour or so? Let's hope I can breeze through this in an hour. Um, we're learning about first attacks. I'm skipping all of his interesting stuff because this is all tutorial, and I don't really care about what he has to say. The writing is charming. There's there's just a lot of it. And we will have more charming characters to come. I have already explained what the Koopa, uh, Koopa links are about. Now, I am missing out on some... Uh, Spanish? Sparkly? Thank you! I will not be safe scumming those bonuses as much as I would like to. But yeah, I've already established what these characters are like through my charming voice acting and re- ah, mm. I ran into them with a the back brother. That is unfortunate. You are gonna get a- oh, you didn't. I have enough speed. Um. But yeah, I guess I technically missed out on, like, one battle's worth of experience, which, in the grand scheme of things, is not going to be a whole lot. I'm going to be doing a pretty breezy playthrough of this. And yes, please stash me up good for the, the bonus luck, which I don't really need. More just for discounts on items in the future, if I'm being honest. Because your stash is your luck stat is also your item shop discount. Did I need to help that guy out? Can't remember if it's important. Anyways, that was the entirety of the Koopa Cruiser from a straight linear path onwards. There is there is no other locations in here, well, other than moving through here. Huh? What? What in the hey? Who did this? Who put the cargo in this area? How are we supposed to get to the deck with this in the way? Hitting that block there activates a uh, pinch crane. I like to call it Mr. Pinch. Uh, don't ask me why. Pinch, it's not really obvious. You should be able to use old Mr. Pinch here to move that cargo. We have achieved Mr. Pinch. Luigi helping out, just standing, showing you where you need to go. Uh, the AI is a little finicky though. Oh, looks like a great mistake you for cargo. That looks, uh, uncomfortable. Hey, since you're up there, why don't we use you for a lookout? So how Mario got past there with Luigi almost constantly as lookout, I, I don't know. And now the scale of the deck is a little bit more reasonable. Your rancidness. 
We will soon pass over the border between the mushroom and the bean bean kingdoms. Ah, nice work. You can go back to Polo Decks now. <coughs> yeah. I don't know how your eyes are passing through the binoculars, but good job on that. Eyebrows I can understand going above. Hey, what's all the hoopla? Bowser is voiced by Tim Allen in this game, by the way, with that. Who would have thought you'd catch up to the great Kakadet even in a hundred million years? North, the fate who stole Princess Peach's voice. How dare you pull off such a cool evil plan? Oh, I did. And now I'm going straight back to the Bean Bean Kingdom so my next plan can take root. I have time to chat with the likes of. I have no time to chat with the likes of you. Sorry, I misspoke. Too busy if I. Rocket, rocket chair. Rocket, rocking chair. Father, take care of this. Well, this is gonna go. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. I am the. What voice should I give Kakuta? It's very important. I am the great Kakuta, most and best pupil who is named Fafu. I am here, laughing at you. If you are giving us the chase just to get to your silly princess's voice, then you are idiots of foolishness. Princess Peach's sweet voice will soon be the bread that makes the sandwich of Gagletta's desire. And this battle shall be the delicious mustard on that bread. The mustard of your doom. I am overly important. Self-aggrandizing, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Next, it is the turn of you! Welcome to a recurring bit villain! I... One that you don't battle, really, throughout the game? They're just kind of... There? Why did this guy get so popular? Uh, Bowser used portal technology to warp around the back of the Koopa Cruiser. Because we can see the railing at the bottom and the top. I know, I know how to dodge this guy's attacks. And... Bowser again with that warp technology. I understand how to read the uh, time cues there. You're giving me enough information. I do have readiness for this. And in case your, uh, your speech bubbles didn't give it away, I think also which way your headgear mouth spins... Yeah, the spin uh, signifies Luigi, and then just the regular one signifies Mario. We are golden. I don't. I don't have to. This is where I ram you. Well, you can try. But how have you used your arms? This is it. This is the battle, folks. Good job. Now that one was not a timed one. Uh, I think we did actually have to do the correct amount of damage to them. Me thinks? Me question marks? Infinite number of headgears, by the way. I have fury! But now is when the talking stops. I do not have time to stop and smell foul roses such as you. One fell swoop is the way I will deal with you, big rats. Yeah. <laughs> 